Assignment groups or categories are an important part of how grades are displayed in Canvas. Every course will have a preset assignment group determined by their department or curricular area. Those assignment groups will be set to a certain percentage depending on your subject. When you create an assignment in Canvas, you will have to assign it to one of the assignment groups for your course. If you go to your Assignments tab, you will be able to see the assignment group set up for you. In this example, you can see that this course has three assignment groups. Formative assessment is set at 30% of the grade. Summative assessment is set up for 70% of the grade. And because this is a middle school course, life and career skills is a category set at 0% of the grade. Looking at this grade book, this student has scored a 79.94% on all formative and summative assessments so far in the course. 30% of that grade has come from the formative assessments. 70% comes from the summative assessments. Notice that this student is getting a 100% on life and career skills. But because life and career skills are worth 0% of the grade, that score does not affect the overall score for this course. Finally, the letter grade represented by the total column has been determined by the traditional grading scheme set in this course. If this teacher were teaching with proficiency grading and a proficiency grading scheme, this percentage would produce a different letter grade. Do you have any questions about your assignment categories? If you do, see your technology integration coach or your curricular IST. I hope this video helped you learn more about assignment categories. Thank you for watching.